It's even worse than I expected. The man I knew was flawed, but he could still muster a little warmth. Huh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. There's hope for everyone. I don't think any of us are beyond reach. <laughs> I know we've just met, but somehow I knew you'd say that. What? You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but it's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Oh, I call the downstairs bed. <laughs> Careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. I'm getting really tempted to touch something. <laughs> How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something. Handcart? Wonder what he was moving. Hey, Bruce. I've been wanting to talk to you. Alone. You have? I don't like how cozy Catwoman was with Riddler. Because he was a killer? Because he was rude to me! We need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. You're right, John. I am. Of course I am. <laughs> Watch out. In case she tries to make a move. John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask. What do you see in Harley? A ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> I I've been meaning to ask it. The green hair, what what is what is that? I don't know, what's with your black hair? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm, I'm a little sensitive about my style. No, didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to... Well, here it was. I guess it's natural. Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me! Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know? Made me look like an idiot! In front of Harley. Those other guys. But hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. wonderful way to lose your hand. Well, you know what they say. Curiosity killed the cat. There's something under here. Some kind of platform. Let me help you out there, Bruce. I don't want you to bend your cover bow. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Welcome to the Maelstrom. Deeper and deeper you go. This is the vortex of life, pulling you down into its depths. You work, you sleep, you die. At all times, one foot in the grave until the second inevitably follows. You have to work hard and sleep hard in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. Uh... <laughs> oh, you're not ready to die just yet. Oh, wait. Yes, you are! <laughs> in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. This is where he built his boxes. <sighs> That's odd. To truly understand my mind, you must first walk a mile in my... Well, certainly you know the rest. Be careful what you said on those. Sure proud of his exploits, wasn't he? Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. Canned food, and lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. Riddler's shoes. He didn't exactly have great fashion sense. Well, he did say something about a foot. I take you by night, by day take you back. None suffer to have me, but do from my lack. <laughs> that sounds positive. Nice. 
city. This is my plan. Nobody will interfere. <laughs> oh, goody. It looks like you've got both feet in the grave. Standing on an elevator. I bet whatever we're looking for is down there. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Or maybe you could stay? Oh no. Harley gave me an assignment, and I mean to fulfill it. We'll go first. Make sure it's safe. Bruce, you... you care about me that much? And here I thought I was losing you to her. I'll be on the next one, so... so don't die before I get there. <laughs> Something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I'm undercover. For yourself? <laughs> Isn't Bruce Wayne kind of always undercover? Or is it the other way around? No, yes, I'm undercover working with a group called the Agency. Partnered up with people, huh? Good to hear you've grown a bit. Sorry if I was a little rattled at the clubhouse back there. Wasn't quite ready to see your face again, but... You look good. Even with what looks like a piercing gone wrong. Not great or anything. But... good. So, you and Riddler... But you were a thing? Listen, nothing happened between Eddie and I. Nothing other than a few felonies. Don't worry. You'll always be my number one in Gotham. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this... pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. You're better than that. You keep saying that. You're like a broken record. Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty... Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. We've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about. Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did, but they were purely aesthetic. You think it might be a trap? Maybe, but we already made it past the line of security, so maybe not. Your certainty is assuring. something nearby we can use. I mean, there's gotta be a password, right? It's what we came here for. It's at least worth a try. Riddles. <laughs> a little on the nose, don't you think?
USB drive. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Time out. The fastest protocol is active. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, their group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius, this is my fault. My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. Doing. Balancing the scales. You are not leaving here with that. Oh, honey. I'm already gone. you are with your hands. <laughs> Awfully bold move, considering we just met, Mr. Wayne. This is flirting. Move, laptop for myself and I'm finishing this my way <clears throat> Harley's laptop huh you and I we're going to talk somewhere else Just... 
stuff. So, John, about the laptop. Um... You know, I'm the first guy who resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, get in her good graces. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll do just that. Then she remember my name as an H in it. Because we're friends, John, this is between us. Oh, we are friends. We are. But Harley's... Harley? I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? I guess you could say, she's my Harley. I'm not sure she's good for me, but I just can't seem to get away from her. You stop right there, Bruce Wayne. I'm tearing up. Look at this couple of weeping willies over here, <laughs> drowning our sorrows in caffeine and sugar. <sighs> if only Harley saw me, like really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> I see. You're up to bat then, Wayne. What did you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? People aren't as complex as you make them out to be. Harley's smart, but she's still human. She can be manipulated just like anyone else. Anyone, huh? How does one go about performing this magic trick? Find a problem they have, and then make sure they think you are the only one who can solve it. Once they have to rely on you, they're yours. <laughs> We're social animals, John. Might as well exploit it. But how do you know what makes them tick? Too bad you can't just open them up and take a look. You just need to talk to them. Just, they'll reveal themselves soon enough. Give them something small about yourself, something insignificant that maybe they already know, but you act like it's a confession, and then you watch the floodgates open. I see, I see. Yeah, that reminds me. Did I ever tell you I was locked up in a mental hospital? Not too long ago, either. Nice try. I've learned that manipulation can take on many forms. Some of them more subtle than others. Tell me more. Tell me everything. Get inside their head. Once you know how they think, you know what they want. And you use that. You know, one of the doctors in Arkham tried to get in here. Wait, wait. I have an idea. Let's try it out. First thing that comes to your head, what do you see? But don't think, let your gut guide you. Pearls, like a broken necklace. How poetic. That's emblematic of loss right there. I've lost two, Bruce. Did you know you're not supposed to put a new male guinea pig with a female who just had pups? I didn't. Do you know what they do? They kill them. All of them. And not because they're evil. No. It's just biology. No one can help what's in their DNA. <laughs> You're an interesting case study, Mr. Wayne. I think you might be a danger to yourself and others. <laughs> Is what Dr. Leland would always say to me.
like a ladder. I can see that. A ladder doesn't care if you're going up or coming down. It just is. Kind of like the universe in general, right? So what else are we to do but have some fun along the way? What an illuminating evening this has been, Bruce. I feel like we're on the verge of a breakthrough. Let's try just one John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's, it's fine. A for effort, Bruce. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. We are friends, and you're right about that. And uh, we did have a good back and forth with the tests. I feel so much closer. <laughs> it's nice. Drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. <laughs> okay, let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Bruce? Happy now? <laughs> Don't look so pleased with yourself. Oh, it's good you're here. The last time I fired this up, you didn't show. Had me concerned. What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place and you decide not to show? Oh, that ain't like you. You don't take time off. Waller ordered me to stand down. You're kidding! The nerve on her! I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. But then it was just Bane. He still beat us to a pulp and got away. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... I got a favor to ask. Lucius Fox. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Not entirely. I don't know anything about that. Maury was an arms dealer, and Riddler targeted him the same way he did Fox. My gut is telling me that's no coincidence. Waller shut down any investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. He could follow that stench all the way to Fox's employer. Look, just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? He's another friend. You know, for a loner, you sure seem to have a lot of friends. You might want to start choosing them more carefully. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. And who was leading her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. And strike three? One of my officers gets bashed in the head while he goes into Riddler's old workshop. Bruce Wayne is dirty and he's dangerous. 
Waller knows all of this happened, too. And she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. That's the favor. I can't do it. But you can. I know what it looks like, Gordon. But Wayne isn't dirty. You're wrong, you know. His whole thing, it doesn't add up. Gotham safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that'll put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. I should have done this a year ago. Dropping threats and walking away. You've hit a new low, Jim. Yeah, I learned to live with it. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. And you. You better not tell her we're coming. He sounds like he's on a warpath. If I warn Selena and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. It's my fault Gordon is like this. I want to tell him everything, but I can't. Secrets poison relationships, Bruce. But to protect this city, to protect yourself, he can't know. You know, Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? I know how you feel about her. Make certain you aren't letting that cloud your judgment. She already betrayed me back at the workshop. Yes, Catwoman's motives will always be suspect. You know what must be done. This is a big butt. 
I need you to promise nothing bad will happen to Harley. I mean, letting one criminal slip through the cracks every once in a while can't be the worst thing. That depends on what she does. If she hurts innocents, then I stop her. Well, that's... you really... This is what dedication looks like, huh? Well, if I get the laptop, uh, there is no score, so win-win. Now, now, when you're on the job, what's the preferred method of extracting a target? Always repelling in, or explosives as a distraction, or... You know what? I'll wing it. If I were you, I'd get a friend to help. That's a great idea! I hope Bruce is there. He'd do anything for me. Oh, one last thing! <laughs> Like these, they mean a lot to me. But what the? No pictures. Laptop behind the stack deck. Well, I hope you weren't counting on a specific time because, you know, that's what I use my phone for.